Hello guys, welcome to today's class. Uh, welcome to Fish Academy. Today we want to discuss an, uh, an interesting topic as usual. And today, you see I'm in the classroom, uh, so we want to do a practical uh, uh, identification of. Uh, first of all, welcome to Fish Academy. Okay, so welcome to Fish Academy. Uh, Fish Academy. Uh, we you know all that we do in case you are joining us for the first time. It's all about fish farming. How you can go about successful fish farming, and then it's an online platform, a, a channel on YouTube where you can learn about fish farming for free. Okay, so today I I have I have three fish with me here. You know, most people have been calling me and they said, Francis, they want to see the, they want to see the different types of catfish, like the Ectrobancus, Longifilis, the uh, uh, Clara's Garipin, uh, Garipinus, and then the hybrid. Okay, so today I have those fish here. You are going to see it with your eyes. It's not the ones that you've been reading and it looks as if it's abstract to you. So today is... Should I tag it? Identification Identification of uh, Identification of uh, Should I say uh, Of uh, Clara's Clara's uh, Caripinus, this space, uh, uh, let me put it here. The Caripinus, okay. Clara's Caripinus. Okay, and then the Ectrobancus. Ectrobrancus. 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 Okay, so this is uh, this uh, this is actually what we want to actually uh, uh, look into. Don't forget identification of Clara's garipin, gari, garipinus, identification of Ectrobancus longifilis, and identification of hybrid, which is a crossbreed between the Clara's Garipinus and the Ectro Bancrus. So you are going to see how they look like. And on the line this word, today we are looking at the uh, identification. Identification, we are, will still discuss more about the different types of catfish in terms of their growth, their feeding, their characters, their market value, and everything. Okay, we we'll dis we'll discuss that. Might not be in this particular video. Okay, but for you to follow up on this, uh, for you to follow up on this uh, topic, or uh, yeah, for you to follow up on this topic with the ones I've just mentioned, which I will be seen earlier. All you need to do, in case you are new to this channel, all you need to do is for you to look by the uh, uh, right hand side 
of your system, your laptop, your phone, or your... So you click on the red subscribe button just below the right hand side of the video. You see like this, subscribe. You see it inside, it's red. I'm not the red barrel, red pen, I would have done that. So you click on this, click on this. Once you click on this, you'll be able to be, not, you, you get uh, you get notification. And also once you click on this, also endeavor to turn on, once you click on this subscribe button, you will see a bell will pop up. You see something like this. A bell will pop up. You know, so all you need to do is for you to also click on this bell. You see three, the three. Then you click on the last one on top where you see all, which means you get all notification from this channel. Anytime we upload video, you click on it, okay, for more updates. So that anytime we upload video, you'll be one of the first person to see our videos. And then, if you like what we are going to discuss at the end of the day, at, well, if you like what we are going to discuss at the end of the day, we have this. Then we have this. We have the like and the unlike. Okay? So at the end of the day, at the end of the day, if you wish to click on the like button now, you can do that. At the end of the day, if you like what we are doing, you can click on this. If you don't like what we've done, you can actually click on the dislike button. That is uh, up to you. Is something that uh, we should do. All right. So, as I said, we're talking about identification. What? How do ethro bankers looks like? First of all, I'm going to make the diagram here on the board before I bring the fish for you to see. Okay. So first of all, let me do some sketch. Please uh, don't mind my sketch. So I'm going to do this one. I'm going to uh, uh, use some letters for it. The ep okay, let me ectero. Ep ectero. Ectero. Brown. And then I I also bring the Claras and then the hybrid. Don't forget all that I'm saying here is you are going to see it with your eyes. So for the for the egg throw, we have it like this. Let's take The ectro, we have it like this, you know, this is how they always look like, okay, and then and then we have, you see something like this. Okay, you see something like that. You 
you see something like that okay i'm going to tell you the difference all right and then for the clearers you see something like this i'm not good in drawing Okay. You see something like this. Don't forget you are going to see this fish with your eyes. This is I'm doing this on the board now. In the afternoon, I'm going to bring it. It's practical in case I didn't write anything. So it's practical. So for the hybrid, for the hybrid, I mean for the claras, you see something like this. Okay. And then for the for the hybrid, you see something like this. Okay. So you see something like this. Okay. What are the difference? What are the difference here? There is one different. There is one thing that you must note as regards ectrobancus. There is the presence of the adipose uh, adipose fin. presence of adipose adipose fin and what is adipose fin adipose fin is that fleshy like fin in a fish okay usually seen at the dozo uh, by the dozo, uh, uh, close to the dozer fin okay so fleshy like soft just like the fish it looks like the skin of a fish itself why this part has the main fin, okay? So the ectrobancus have what is known as adipose, adipose fin, okay? So I don't want to take much of your time, as I said today. We're going to continue on this topic as I'm going to be bringing you the characteristics, the feeding, and then everything, the market value, that is, uh, yeah, and all that about these three types of fish that I have mentioned and the one that you should uh, the one that you in terms of characteristics the ones that stay longer the ones that are not easily affected by disease and all that we are going to discuss on that but for today is identification don't forget it's practical so let's go straight to identification of the fish so you see it with your eyes okay Okay, so starting with uh, the Ectrobancus uh, longifilis, as I said, longifilis. So as I said, is identification. So we have this. This is it. It's, oh my, it's still it's still moving. So so this is uh, the adipose. The the. So, uh, as you say, is identification of uh, uh, ectrobancus. So, I told you guys that the ectrobancus have uh, two fin almost divided into 50-50. Okay, or well, this like 60-40. Uh, and then I told you in that diagram I drew on the board. This is the fin here, and then this is the adipose fin. 
you can see it's just like flesh soft in fact you cannot actually if they should cut this from here and here they should cut this into the pot you might not actually know that this is fin so this is the adipose adipose fin okay so this is ectro bancus okay let me use the opportunity to see if it's a female uh, ectro bancus or a male ectro bancus i did not actually uh check that okay this is a very strong fish okay okay wow this happens to be this happens to be a male um, a female ectro bancus since we are still talking about the identification right let me uh, use this medium to show you how to identify a female uh, catfish african catfish can you see can you see oh my God. Uh, the fish is very strong and stubborn okay okay so this is it okay 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 it's male i can see this is the papilla this is the papilla as it's growing it will actually come up this is the enos and this is the uh, papilla it will grow up just as the fish is growing all right so this is the ectrobancus longifinis so um, what I want to bring out next now is the clara. So you see the absence of the adipose fin in the claras. All right. Okay, here, here is a claras. Here is claras, uh, almost the same size. As you can see, as I drew on the board, you see how the body, how the body is, and then you can see the fin. The fin is from a to z you can see there is no division anywhere it's 100 percent from the starting point to the finishing point by the tail so there is no division at all so this is the clara's the clara's uh, uh clara's uh, garipin uh, uh, pinus all right so the next one i'm going to bring out now is the hybrid so you see the difference between hybrid and then you see the difference between Hectro and Clara. So let me get the hybrid here. So let me also check if this is male or female. Okay, this happens to be a female, a female, this female Clara's. All right. Here is uh, our hybrid. As you can see, I showed you the other time uh, this is hybrid, almost like uh, the Ectrobancus and also almost like the Claras. It's a crossbreed of uh, both uh, Ectrobancus and Claras. That's why you can see the presence of the adipose fin. But this time around, the fin we have here, the main fin is like, uh, let's say we can say 90 to 10 uh 90 uh, to 10 okay so this part actually carry 90 percent of the dozo fin and then the adipose taking just 10 percent of the entire fin all right so this these are this is hybrid okay this hybrid and they do well you can see is the fish is actually doing very very well so we have this in good number in my farm as we are using it for studies and then oh, and all that um so this this is it you can see i don't know if you can see this well the fish is still active it's still very much alive this is the adipose fin soft fleshy just in fact it's just like there's nothing you can't actually differentiate between this and this you can actually fillet it alongside the main flesh okay so let me uh, check if this is male or female hybrid okay this okay this is a female this is a, uh, this is a male hybrid have the papilla and the papilla will grow long as the fish also grows all right okay so with this we've been able uh, to identify the life life this time around as i said i don't believe much on theory i believe in 
I believe purely on practical. You know, when, when I was in school, I do well in my practical courses than the theoretical courses, okay? So something that you see, you can actually tell someone this is how it is. So today you've been able to see that free, okay, without, without you paying any money for it. Okay, so if you like what were the lesson for today, which is identification of Clara's Garipinus, identification of Ectrobancus longifilis, and then the hybrid, which is a crossbreed of the uh, Ectro and Clara's. If you like the lesson for today, which is a very short lesson, you can, as I said earlier, if you are joining us for the first time, if you've not yet subscribed to our channel, if the subscribe button below the video by the right hand side is still showing red, it means you have not subscribed, okay? And if it's showing black and there is D added to the subscribe, it means you are already a subscriber. We have a lot to bring to you as regards this fish that I've shown you, as regards the hybrid, as regards the ectrobancus, as regards the uh, claras garipinos. I have a lot to tell you guys about this, talking about their characteristics, talking about their, uh, their, their economic importance, talking about their health benefit, talking about so many things. We are going to be bringing lesson as regards this three uh, this fish and other fish that we have in the farm including our tilapia and a lot more so just do well to click on the subscribe button do well to click on the subscribe button by the right hand side of your phone it's red it's red click on it and also if you like the lesson for today do well to Turn to like our video, okay? Do well to like our video if you like what we've done today. It will really, it, it will actually, uh, if it will really uh, motivate me to do more. Uh, it uh, is a, a sign of feedback, and then with this, we'll do more. So thank you very much. Till I come your way again, I remain your humble friend, your friend, Kufre Ibanga Francis of Fish Academy. And if you are looking, okay. My phone number will be displayed, is displayed there on the screen, including our email address and also our website. And also, if you wish to support us, if you wish to support our program, um, this is not a non-sponsored program. There is nobody sponsoring this program. But if you wish to sponsor the program, you wish to sponsor this channel, you can also reach out to us through our email and we'll be glad uh, to have you as one of our sponsors. Thank you very much. So like on your way again. Bye. Don't forget, we have interesting topics on this.